He definitely brought the energy. let's just say that. We are here at the Australian premiere of The Fall Guy. So, it's lights, camera, action. What's the process like casting them as Colt and Jody in the film? What was their chemistry like? Well, it was pretty immediate. You know, uh, we brought Ryan on to the movie uh, even before we had a script. You know, um, he came on and really helped us crack the tone and like set a direction for what we all wanted to do. So he's one of the key collaborators. Emily came on after we just did a, a, a rewrite of the first draft. Now, Kelly, we were talking before about Ryan being a part of the production quite early on. Did he bring the right amount of Kennedy to the film and, and the production. I it truly was. think it's a great moment for him because I think Ken is actually a really hard thing to come out from under and still thrive. I mean, there are actors who would only be Ken for the rest of their lives if he weren't as amazing and versatile as Ryan Gosling. I think in Colt, he has somebody who he can, you know, sort of do also and and will, and has a resonance that's almost as strong as Ken's. Speaking of some of the stunts, I remember when the Sydney Harbour Bridge was shut down. Oh, uh, so sorry. No, it didn't affect me. I thought it was fantastic. But <laughs> anywhere on early Sunday morning. Come on, you guys. <laughs> yeah, take a break. Have a coffee. Yeah. We're only up for hours. <laughs> who makes that decision to close it down for a day? I'm not sure, but Philip Roop is was our location manager, and he holds the keys to the kingdom and maybe a lot of photos that. <laughs> Nobody wants to have seen. What was one of the most ambitious stunts in the film that you got to accomplish? Cars, high falls, fire. So we kind of, we, we hit the gambit. I don't think yeah. we had, we didn't have any horses. No horses. We hit a, yeah. what? Yep, maybe. Yeah. Oh, we have to watch the film to find out what that meant. And who's your favorite, Ryan or Emily? <laughs> Why should people watch The Fall Guy on the big screen? Come on, how can you not? <laughs> it's, it's made to sit with a group of people and get the feels and have fun and laugh. And um, every day on set, we really thought about what would the audience like. And that, and that includes spectacle, that includes like some romance, that includes comedy. And it's just best enjoyed with a, a group of people. Like I, it's made for the cinema and that's was intended that way. And um, that's the movies we like to make. Well, that's a wrap. Be sure to check out The Fall Guy on the big screen at Hoyt's from April 24th. In three, two, one. Action. Where would you go for the one that you love? I'll buy you a drink when this is over. Engage your core. Fish do it later. Wanna go to a beach somewhere? Drink a spicy margarita. Make some bad decisions. Yes!